Oh, how was last night? Good. Well, I'm still editing the video. Uh, I, one thing I really hate is about sports videos is it's a lot of editing, a lot of work to it, and that patience. Right? Are you still tired from last night? A little bit. We didn't get home till about quarter, almost quarter after three. I got up at six though and get on the computer. <laughs> yeah. It was a rough night last night, yeah. By the way, hello YouTube. Hello YouTube, yeah, we're still And tired. congratulations to the St. Louis Blues for going to the Stanley Cup. Finals? Uh, finals. Versus the Boston Bruins. It's a, Everybody it's a was chanting last night, we want the cup. Yeah. Oh yeah, I, right now I'm editing, I'm trying to get to that part of that editing, of that, well, the video that just watched last night. Uh, yeah, sports videos. Uh, I love to do them. But they're a pain to edit. Uh, hey, uh... Hold little, it. Oh, what? We got this last night after the game. Yeah, we got to show that last night. Here, lean back so it's not glaring in the sun. Yeah, it's just like this. That's what we got. Everybody was handed this out last night as we left the building last night. We forgot to show it uh, at the end of last night's video. Yep. And you want to show the towel again real quick? And everybody, every seat had one of these last night, right? Yes. So that was pretty good. Uh, yeah. So uh, if anybody caught us, hold it. Hold it. Oh no. You guys know me and Rocket did an errand. Yeah. Before, as during the civil defense siren last night, you guys took off on us. We went to Bush Stadium. <laughs> Why? For those things. To give it to my dad. Oh. Okay. I won't touch them. <laughs> Yeah, sorry about the uh, camera angle here. I've been busy uh, editing this video. Like I said, sports videos are uh, tough to edit because there's just so many highlights. And uh, we try to get as good highlights as possible, but we want to keep the excitement of the Blues playoffs. Even as us as Blackhawk fans, uh, we have to, you know, you have to say Blues deserves to go to the Stanley Cup because the one thing both Blackhawks and the Blues had in common they switched coaches during the year uh, for the Blackhawks things went uh, from bad to worse why the Blues went from bad and got better uh, basically because uh, it was a different philosophy by the coach and it looks like uh, that they hi that they hired it looks like they're going to keep them on uh, basically I think they heard did we hear on the way home that they're offering the coach a, a contract extension for the St. Louis Blues? Yes. Because they hired him as an intern coach for the end of the season, but they got him in the playoffs. So I guess, I guess, some of the St. Louis uh, subscribers have to tell us, did the, did the Blues hire their coach for, gave him an extended contract, uh, basically. That's what we're asking. But that's what we thought we heard coming home. But then when we come home, it was tired. Oh, by the way, I drove uh, a couple hours, uh, about an hour and a half uh, after uh, I drove from uh, Homestead, uh, Homestead Rest Area up to uh, Lincoln. Lincoln, Illinois, uh, basically. So, because uh, if I said Lincoln, people think of Lincoln, Nebraska. But yeah, up in Lincoln, up to Lincoln, Illinois. They, they wanted me to stop at a rest area, and I saw all the rest areas. When we left Homestead, and all the other rest areas was jam-packed with trucks and that, and I didn't feel like uh, coming in and <laughs> uh, probably no problem finding a, a parking spot in the car, but just coming in off the interstate at a high rate of speed, and, and you got trucks on the parking lane, I thought, no, nah, it would be safer I go to a uh, truck stop slash uh, gas station. Uh, that's what we did. Uh, we drove up to... Uh, uh, that's why we drove from uh, Homestead uh, rest area all the way up to, uh, but I wasn't putting it on camera, on film, but the battery on the cell phone was almost dead, so I couldn't do another live show, and I forgot to mount this up on, because uh, this had good night vision, uh, base, and I forgot to do that, and the video was running long anyway, so that's why I'm editing. Oh, I'm pooped out already, and it's already 10 after 2, it took me almost two hours uh, to edit that video. I'm tired. I'm still tired. We're all still tired uh, from last night, right? 
like I said, if you have not, if you have watched that game six uh, from St. Louis versus the Sharks, if you saw us in the one corner of, it'd be the corner up here where I'm pointing, uh, of the TV screen, uh, when you watch the game at home, if you were to watch that game, and you saw us wearing our Mallard jerseys, I was waving the towel around. That was probably the only time we met on TV. But then it all depends what they put the score box at. If they put the score box up here, then you will never saw us. If you put it someplace else, like it should, then you'll be able to see us. Uh, like I said, it all depends. I just went through uh, YouTube to check their NHL highlights. Uh, no luck. Uh, so I couldn't really share it. I checked a couple of other videos. On Facebook. Okay. Blues, sorry. Blue stuff. Uh, I'll have to check it out myself because I really want to share a clip to show you where we was at. But we were close enough. You guys saw the video. <sighs> yeah, I'm just going to sit out here. As soon as I get done rendering that video, I'm going to go up back and take a nap. It was a long day yesterday uh, doing yesterday's video. And of course, doing two live shows on top of that. And uh, that was that was great. Uh, we had fun. Uh, at least they didn't come after us with pitchforks and torches. If St. Louis would have lost, they would probably would have done it already. All right, uh, we'll see you in a little bit here. One more clip, and I think we're gonna wrap up the video. Oh yeah, uh, long day. Uh, every time I do a sports video uh, that we always like to do, it doesn't matter if it's Lumber Kings baseball or even that Cubs game we did uh, in 2017 up in uh, Milwaukee, because we had to keep the highlights down because we had other stuff in the video. Uh, and every time we do hockey uh, videos, it's just having the camera on at the right time. And down in St. Louis, it just didn't work out because we had to use the cell phone to do the video. Uh, when we did the uh, Blackhawks game, we used this camera, uh, the Sony cam. Uh, they had a little looser camera policies in, at the United Center as of 2017 uh, than uh, the Enterprise Center in St. Louis. So, uh, basically, so uh, it kind of hurt the video somewhat, kind of hurt the video quality somewhat, but we did what we can. Uh, hopefully it turned out. Maybe lower seating probably was uh, in order to get a good video like that, but I don't know. Uh, right now, like I said, I'm, re I'm currently rendering it up right now. You guys probably just watched it last night. Probably left a lot of good comments. Boston Pop fans probably left a lot of crappy comments. Probably insulting comments. But I always say <laughs> go Blackhawks. Because we're mainly Blackhawks fans. But uh, the, our subscriber Rocket aka Tony. And they're mostly Blues fans uh, basically. So uh, yeah. So it was a great game. Uh, we had fun. That's all it is. Having fun, uh, basically. But I'll tell you what. When we wore those Mallard jerseys uh, down there around the arena, I didn't mention this last night's video, uh, we had a lot of positive comments on those Mallard jerseys. And unfortunately, like I said, the Mallards don't play anymore because the team is defunct. Uh, East Coast Hockey League owns the naming rights to the Quad City Mallards. So now... There's a, there's a different hockey team in Quad Cities. It's called the Quad City Storm. Uh, they wanted to call it the Mallards, but the East Coast Hockey League, to help the Mallards' financial situation, they had they bought the naming rights. So they own the naming rights for whatever, how long they want it, uh, basically. But uh, but that's sports uh, politics, basically. So uh, that's basically what it was. But, yeah, doing sports videos, doesn't matter if it's high school football. I did a couple of them. Uh, a few hockey games and baseball games, they're hard to film, they're hard to edit because you got to find the right highlights at the right location and put it in the right low <laughs> in, in sequence and it's not easy to do. Uh, especially when you have to film with a cell camera because my cold numbers change all over. The, uh, it changes drastically so I had to remember the clip I used last. Okay, uh, yeah, it's it can be tiring uh, doing videos, and it can be tiring just uh, editing videos. But last night, we just when we came home early this morning, late last night, early this morning, mainly early this morning, about an hour or about an hour and a half before daybreak, uh, it was uh, 
very fatiguing, uh, basically, very tiring. And right now, I'm going to go take my nap. All right, well, let me go check my rendering, and then I'll take my nap. Okay, oh, like I said, I'm still tired from the editing. Yeah, what do you want? How long should I set the timer for? Uh, hour and a half timer, okay? That's my normal nap, an hour and a half. You need a pillow? Yes. There, there's your pillow. <laughs> And then you can clean up the bedroom tomorrow. Okay, I sure will. All right. Remind me, guys, tomorrow, clean the bedroom. Oh, that's not funny, Angie. Oh. Oh, you're napping too, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess we'll all need it. Okay, I just got up for a nap. We're gonna. We're going to upload the video later tonight, uh, basically, just make sure, uh, because, you know, when you go to sporting events, there's always a risk of background music, so, uh, we're going to upload it later, and if we have to, uh, fix it, we can fix it later by, uh, reducing or, or eliminating some clips, but I think I'm happy with the video that we have produced it, uh, for you yesterday, but right now, uh, like I said, just got up from my nap, Angie's napping, and uh, we'll probably come back later. Uh, I gotta do some stuff, uh, basically. And uh, we'll see you later tonight. All right. Well, Angie's playing her farm game. Uh, hey, it's uh, ten thirty. It's actual really bedtime. <laughs> no, I'm going to bed shortly, guys. And Angie's probably gonna go to bed in a little bit as soon as she gets on the farm. And uh, yeah, we were tired today, so it looks like I'm. I normally go to bed at two or three o'clock in the morning. Uh, but for some reason, I was just flat out tired, uh, because maybe I didn't take my nap yesterday, right? Because... We have a busy day tomorrow off camera. Oh, uh, not just off camera, but I'm going to do something on camera with these guys, too. Oh. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take you guys someplace on camera. Uh, let's put it this way, uh, I don't know, do you want me to bring home something if I do? Yeah, but you got to be... Okay. Yeah. 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 But I'll 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 do something with, with the guys uh, tomorrow. Okay. Okay. We'll we'll figure something out. Okay. Yeah. We're supposed to uh, clean out and sort out the bedroom too. On top of that, uh, basically. So I'll tell you what. Let's go. Let's all tie. We're all tired. Let's all go to bed right now. Uh, please like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, notification bell, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.